The Omaha Children's Museum recently opened up its newest exhibit. This one combines the magic of Harry Potter and the science of Bill Nye. For example, this exhibit here showcases the difference in between velocity and friction on a zip line and how gravity also plays a part in zip lines so you can reach all the way down here. Let's check it out. The learning starts as soon as you walk in at the Magical Archway. As kids enter and the lights turn on, so it's because of infrared radiation actually detects it and turns on the fun lights in here. So that's our entrance into this exhibit. Once through the archway, we saw their magic house, the floating head table, and the light maze. Both the floating head table and the light maze utilize the illusions that could be created from mirrors and light placement when they're combined. The magic house is where kids can find out some facts about famous scientists accompanied by the fun of slides. This one I really like for the educational purposes. It's a, your typical climber in the front and in the back with slides but each of these Van Gogh inspired renderings of famous modern day scientists, but also has a lot of really great information on Nikola Tesla and George Washington Carver and how these people invented our modern day magic or science. They have a special guest who joins them for their educational and interactive shows. This is Thistle, the resident storytelling dragon, and here's where they do their live experiments. We have a lenticular shield which demonstrates invisibility. We have sodium acetate crystallizing. We have um, a big whoosh bottle fire where we have a combustion reaction. Madison was kind enough to do the combustion reaction experiment for us. She starts out with a little bit of isopropyl alcohol. And I put about oh, a tablespoon and a half in here. Spill a little bit, that's okay. I want to make sure I get the tube of this bottle pretty well. And then we flip it around so it gets covered and evaporates a little bit. We're trying to catch the fumes inside. And then typically in our science show, we use the famous Harry Potter incantation, Incendio, is what we use. So we have them count down with us. Three, two, one, Incendio. And I'm gonna use this lighter here. You might wanna take a little step back. Ooh, all right. <laughs> and there you go. One of the super cool things about this whole exhibit is that each experience in the exhibit has a little science explainer on how this experience is tied into science. The whole purpose of this exhibit is to take what might be magic tricks or magic in pop culture and really demonstrate the science behind it. Uh, it's a great learning opportunity for kids. It makes them super excited about coming here and learning and even reading and furthering on different types of education. We were told that the exhibit has been a huge hit with kids so far and you have until April 16th to check it out. I'm 3 News Now meteorologist Caitlin Connell.